This is going to look really weird. Hey guys, it's uh, Game Hunter here, and we are playing something called Rogue Planet. Uh, I basically was just looking for something very different, and supposedly this game is done, so it is at least very stable, and I don't have to worry about lots of bugs, but so far I really haven't been. Um, but anyway, let's, let's just get right into the game. Um, I guess I'll read the intro in... PD 25550. Before he left our world, he declared, My time has come, and I will soon disappear from this world, but I leave a final remnant with which I shall be remembered. I have learned many things and acquired almost unlimited power, even the ability to create planets. These planets don't orbit stars, and so are called rogue planets. Ha, huh, ha, huh, I get it. On one of them, I have hidden this secret power to create planets. It is yours to find! He disappeared, and his undying words were spread. Adventurers explored distant space, desperate to search all the rogue planets they could find. A long time passed. Finally, on two rogue planets, something was discovered. But instead of the ultimate prize, they had found only the coordinates of other rogue planets. These spread like a fire, and even more people traveled through space, longing to discover the power, he promised. Alright, so, um, I guess let's just play... Um, so we got two places, and, uh, I guess let's go with the one with more food. I bet food's important. <laughs> so let's, let's go ahead and do that, and let's turn on some music. So, oh, okay. The screen gets even smaller. Well, I hope this isn't too hard for you guys to see. I imagine it looks huge on some of your monitors. Um, so, we're in S. Change position. Oh, okay. I guess you can change where you start or something. Alright, well, let's, um... Can we use... Oh, alright. So that's, like, the floor. You probably can't see everything here, but there's really just more leaves, so... Well, that's interesting. And so, right-click... Change position... Oh man, that didn't do anything. So if I double click, yeah, it does that. Well, I think I can use arrow keys. I mean, it says use arrow keys, so I will I will be using arrow keys. Food. Got to get lots of food. I guess kill a monster. I wonder if you can level up for monster stuff. So it seems every turn, food goes down and energy goes up. And these are the stairs already, but let's go get some more food. Um, huh. So this is a very minimalistic game, but I don't know, I kind of like it. Oh, speed's going down, I guess, as a result of picking up food. I guess I could kill this guy. Seems to do stuff, sort of. So, and that's all, like, dead ends. So if I double-click, I can actually see stuff around me. Okay, so that's the point of that. And, uh, space is press button. Okay. Oh, and I can also use escape. All right. So that's more convenient. We're just going to use the arrow keys from now on. So these are all stairs. Kill a monster. Kill more monsters. Let's go down some stairs. Oh, <laughs> that's not a... Oh, okay. So I can use the space key just to go places and do stuff. So yeah, this is like... This is the definition of minimalistic. Look how many stairs there are. It's crazy. So we just keep going down, I guess. And just try to figure out what to do. Oh, that, that was a bad way to go. That was a bad way to go, too. Huh. Well, this probably isn't going to be a very long series. I can tell you that. Let's go get some food. Monsters, food, monsters, and food, and killing monsters, and also getting food for it. So yeah, um, I guess I'll try to talk about stuff while I'm playing, but... In the mean, you know, if something interesting happens in the game, I will let you know. 
And uh, until then, we will kind of talk about other stuff, I guess. Um, what to talk about? There's there's stuff like um, well, I guess this music, for instance, um, this actually comes from a uh, Commander Keen game, but not a normal Commander Keen game. It's actually from a oh, what would you call it? A, a fan make of the game. Oh, dead end. Yeah, it's if you if you like Commander Keen. I mean, I like Commander Keen. Uh, but if you like Commander Keen, then you should probably head to the public Commander Keen forums where you can go and uh, talk about Commander Keen, basically. But more importantly, they have forums dedicated to the release of various uh, fan-based games. And this music comes from... Um, well, th there was an uh, unofficial... If you've... I don't know, followed Commander Keen at all. Uh, the, what was it, the fifth game actually had a, uh, a game where they said Mortimer, which is the, the big bad guy, uh, would have this big showdown with, with Mr. Commander Keen. And uh, it was going to be like a trilogy called The Universe's Toast or something. But ultimately... That was never made because, well, guess what? Commander Keen was made by uh, id Software, and they went on to bigger, more awesome things. Well, okay, that's subjective, but uh, they went on to make games like Wolfenstein 3D, and then Doom, and Quake, and, you know, the rest is pretty much history. Um, I do not know where I am going. So, they, the Commander Keen... Some people, I think uh, the guy's name was Selick, named after a Commander Keen enemy, as a matter of fact. Um, went and started creating the Universe's Toast trilogy, unofficially, of course, but. Um, you know, I should probably be using my map some just to know that I'm going somewhere appropriately. Um, rather than just kind of running around in circles. But, so, the entire trilogy has actually been made, and it was released, the, the final episode was released February of 2011, and this is actually from that. Um, if you're wondering why I have the music playing, uh, it's because I actually ripped the IMF files, um, and then just kind of turned them into waves, and then turned them into MP3s. Because, I mean, the midis, I would need a Sound Blaster card, and I don't have a Sound Blaster card. So, that's just uh, what happened. Man, I am not getting anywhere in this place. I think uh, I'm going to go find some stairs and, like, get the hex out of here. This is confusing. Very confusing. Uh, where is the upstairs here? Is there an upstairs? I guess, am I totally stuck here for... Ev oh, wait, there's the S. Oh, um, Well, that's quite a bit of ways away. Um, can I even get there from here? Oh, there's some food. Let's use that at least to get there. Huh. Right. Well, okay, I'm finding a lot of food. That works, too. Let's just keep going, then. Downstairs, downstairs. Ooh, I think this is the farthest I've ever gotten. <laughs> um... So anyway, yeah, that, this music's from that, and all the music, there was in fact a one music per level, which was pretty awesome, because I'm a musician kind of guy, and I really like having music all over the place, yeah. So, I found that quite nice, really, just to be able to, <laughs> that's a total dead end, to be able to have all that music and really enjoy the game in its musiciness. so... Yeah, this one loops pretty often. Oh boy, dead ends. Um, but I really like it. It's very, it's very simple. It kind of reminds me of the Keen music in in uh, some ways. Some people would probably find that insulting, but uh, I really liked the Keen music. And to actually stick with the Keen music is that's that's choice right there. That's how it's done, you know. So there's 30 floors here. And my objective is mostly to just kind of find my way around and... 
yeah. Try to get there as soon as possible. Let's see. So this is Dead Endsville, and this is also Dead Endsville. Um, so I guess we're just going to go up some stairs. Because we have to, we have no choice in the matter. Okay, and, and more no choice in the matter. Uh, let's see, where else is there? Oh, I, I think I am basic. well, okay, I can go up here. Okay, not bad. I'm glad that the food's plentiful. You can only imagine what it would be like on a planet where there's practically no food. That would suck, basically. <laughs> I don't know how the speed works at all. I really don't. But, but it seems to go... Oh, combos. Huh. Well, there's a combo thing. I don't understand that at all. It seems to be reset whenever you eat. So... So there's that! <laughs> um, I guess let's just start my combo up. I already have a ton of food. Oh, and I guess there it goes again. And I'm stuck! But, um... So this is a very interesting game. I'm... Actually planning, uh, you'll probably see it uploaded along with this one. I'm going to do uh, ro B-Rogue Brogue again, because I felt that, I mean, Adam lasted 11 videos. Uh, B-Rogue only had three in the end. and Although they were kind of long, it's still like, I feel I should redo it a little bit. So where am I now, and can't, where can I go? Is this just a, a reroute of everything? Yeah, it's a, it's a redo of everything. Huh. It's a very odd game, I must say. And I'm already running low on food, I guess. Dang. Very quickly run out of food if you're not careful. Okay, good. Can we actually find some way down this time? Hmm. There's a way down, but it is... Okay, there we go. Ta-da! Okay, there we go. There we go. Oh, there's two ways down. And some bunch of food! Food, food, food. Love the food, love the food. Okay. I don't know what combos do. They probably increase your score or something. If, as if I could be bothered to understand that right now. So let's see. Um, monsters. Food, food, food. So much food right now. I am just in food heaven, basically. So I guess my objective really is to just descend stairs and, and hope that I find whatever's down there. Huh. Well, let's see. Um, and they're all leaves. It's it's pretty great. Every single tile. It's you know you know what this game reminds me of. Uh, does anybody know like that that one chip game on the win on Windows? Uh, game where you basically moved in various directions and had to avoid things and kind of a Frogger based format. Um, yeah, it was, it was, it was fun, because at the time I was like seven or something, so. <laughs> but, no, it was an enjoyable game. I would recommend seven-year-olds playing it. <laughs> Is there anywhere to go? Okay, good. And there's nowhere to go here. Okay. I wonder if there's ever any impossible situations, if these maps are truly random, or is there always um, a guaranteed path from point A to point B. Okay, so that's dead end tree. Yeah, you can't move diagonally. Just, just FYI, if you're wondering why I'm not, it's because I can't. So, there's that. <laughs> more food and more dead ends. Well, there's an area. 
I should probably go there. Oh, either way, this rapidly makes me run out of food. I can only imagine what the speed's for. It's just... There's so many things in this game, they just kind of do sort of silly things. Um... Is there a way to that food? Maybe? Yeah, okay. Oh wow, lots of food. Everywhere, lots of food. All the time, get some. And there's stairs. Good. Finally, the 15th floor. And the 16th floor. And the 17th floor. Oh, oh, where are we going? The 18th floor? Yep, 19th floor. Man, I hope I don't end up totally dead-ending myself here. I hope I'm just getting really lucky. <laughs> so... Hmm. Yeah, energy... Wow, you can get hurt a lot. Uh, let's see. Okay, that's that's total dead ender dead endery. Pick up some food, kill some enemies. Um, guess go down some floors. Okay, dead end. Yes, that is a dead end. Let's see. Not a well, not yet a dead end. Could be a dead end. In theory, nope, that's no, not a dead end. So let's go ahead and. I have a lot of food right now. I hope I don't have to get back. That could be a pain. I have no idea how to get back. <laughs> I have not been leaving breadcrumbs around. 26. Oh, I guess there's the matter of whether or not I end up in the right area to go get the actual treasure at the bottom of this place. Okay, 28. Dead end. Okay, not a dead end yet. Okay, good, good. Oh, that's a dead end. Gotta stop wasting time like that. What do we got here? Dead end. Let's see. I guess I can go that way, sort of. Yeah, okay. Here we go. 29. Dead end. Dang, so many dead ends on 29. It's, it's nasty. Oh, let's see. So I don't know what else is there to talk about. There's there's cool stuff going on all over the place, like Doom RL. Doom RL's got that graphical beta going on, and I would highly suggest either watching the video I did that showed it off, or uh, you know donating and checking it out yourself. And as a matter of fact, I I host a strategy competition. So for any of you who play Doom RL and think that you are pretty good at it, I would suggest uh, checking that out because you could win some donation money in your name and therefore check out the graphical beta. So, man, where is the place to go right now? Can I scroll the map at all? No. But it's usually enough that I can start seeing things. I need to find a way to get over there. Let's see if I can can do that. Nope, this is all dead endery. Um Okay, there's that. That's kind of an up area. Oh, that's a total dead end. Nice. Huh. I think I need to start back from square one, which really kind of sucks. Not total square one, I meant more like, um... Okay, there's a spot, actually, I think. Is it? No, I can't reach that. I can't reach that either. Let's try this. That is, yeah, just normal stuff. Okay, this can be gone through a little bit, though. I need to get up, though. And I am not finding that way to get up. So, we're gonna have to go exploring some more. Uh, not that far up. It's a bit more than I want to go. Except, I guess I have to now. So, let's go ahead and do that. Oh man. I really should have seen that coming. That was like a five-step seen it coming sort of thing. No? Okay, well this is... <sighs> dead end. Dead end... I am going, getting far out of the way right now. Not to mention everything's a dead end. <laughs> everything's a dead end! Um, this is where I came from? Sort of, yeah. What was this? No, that has no potential. Okay. Well, I am starting to run out of food now. Right. I already did that! Oh, man. 
I think I was screwed. I am ski rootiness. And this is back to 20 something. Oy vey. And yeah. So I'm screwed. I think. Probably. I mean, you run out of. You die when you run out of food, basically, right? That's, that's how games work these days. Kids with their. Their energy bars and their. Their PowerPoints and their. Oh man, so much stuff. Okay, there's food. Hooray for food. Hooray for more food. And more food and more food. I require sustenance. Okay, that's sustenance. That's that's something right there. Um So the graphical version of Doom RL I well, I guess I've really explained what there is to explain at the moment in the in the video I made, but that's not the only thing that's new about Doom RL uh, at the moment. Because version 995, in spite of having uh, some bugs here and there, is still chock full of new and exciting things, like a couple new challenges, and uh, well, a, a new single exotic weapon, but that's something, right? Uh, let's see. But there's also the big boss in the episodic format. I didn't get to show you who's at the very end of the game, but uh, I imagine... Oh, darn it. Uh, there's nowhere to go over there. Okay. Well, let's just try going up a little bit, I guess. Yeah, okay. This is making some progress, perhaps. I think I finally managed to make it to the other side, if I'm lucky. Okay, well, I'm definitely... Okay, there's 30. Cool. So now at this point I have to start exploring for a treasure. Which will inevitably be found by me and everything will be okay at that point. Hopefully. Oh wow, okay. These monsters seem to be hurting a lot now. Like, super duper lot. Huh. No idea. <laughs> what I'm supposed to be looking for, though. That is that is definitely a problem. But I imagine that I need to be wary about my various bars and, and things and stuffs. Please be more... Ah! Keep making me go up. And up and up. I do not want to go up. I'm going to backtrack a little bit. For the sake of trying to desperately find a way to go. What about this? No, that's pretty much where I was, I think. Uh, yeah, this is a totally a dead end. Wow. Man, I hope this isn't too boring for you guys. But, um... Well... I mean, I'm certainly enjoying myself doing the commentating and, and stuff, but... For you guys, it's really just watching a square go around. It's... It's very much the very essence of, of old school. Uh, let's see. Nope, this is... What about this? I think I've been here before. Yeah. But, maybe something can be done. Let's just take a look at the map for a little bit. Hmm. Ultimately, I think I want to go up a little bit. So, we will start by exploring upness a little bit. Like right here. Yeah, perfect. This is exactly where I want it to get. Let's see if it doesn't lead us anywhere. Alright. That's... Yeah. Ha, <laughs> that's weird. Okay, food, 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 stairs. Stairs down, good. Lots of enemies, holy crap, lots of enemies. Need more food. Um, let's see. Yeah, this looks pretty dead-end-ish, dead unfortunately. Yeah. Dead-end-ish. So... Gonna have to... No, oh, great, that's complete dead-end. How did I even get here, then? I guess it, I went up more. Yeah, like this. And, uh... Down... Leads... Wow, I've been... Oh, this is 29. Darn it! I gotta stop doing that. Um, although I think I do want to kind of... Right. Kind of screwed on that angle. Oh, food. Hooray! 
for food. It is delicious. Just like candy butterscotch flavoring. I really like... Oh, great. Oh, and now my energy goes down. Ah, oh, great, though. I'm, I'm so screwed. Although my points are really high. Maybe you just win the game if you... If you actually find the treasure. Is that how this works? I need to go somewhere that I haven't been yet. That's kind of important at the moment. Uh, there's no food there. Right. And that's... Yeah. That's that. That's the same darn place. Come on, GH. Yeah, I think you're screwed at this point. Oh, food! Delicious, nourishing, plentiful, bountiful food. It's not going to keep me going forever, though. Ah, blah. Okay, there we go. There's some more. But i got to take the hit to get somewhere to make progress. Whew! Barely survived that one. And my food's starting to come back. Hooray for food! Food is the best. It is almost as important as sleep and ninjas. I mean, I don't think internet memes could have survived without the ninja phase. It was just far too important. And what is this world if we don't have internet? It's, it's some kind of apocalyptic nightmare of politics and the good old days. And who, really, I, that that is not a world I want to live in. All right, let's assess the situation here. Unfortunately, you can't really look at the, the map up in, like, you know, the previous floor and stuff. That would be awfully useful. Awfully useful. Um, I think I was coming from the left, so let's try to go towards the right. And that was absolutely no help at all. Well, maybe it was. Except I've totally been here before all the time. So, what about this? Nope, been here too. Man, I have scoured this place and I'm still not really finding anything. What about this? Nope, dead end. Dead enderies. Starting to get low on food again. I'm running low on food again. Okay, there's food. A very small amount of food, but I will take it. Uh, um, man, I think I'm getting screwed again. Wait, this is a place I haven't been before. Completely useless place I haven't been before, but it's still a place I haven't been before. Gotta take the hit. Hopefully it gets me somewhere. Food. Ah, oh, great. I still gotta pass him. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm screwed this time. This time for sure. Unless there happens to be... Nope. Well, I can at least leave the planet. Well, look at that. That's a planet. Uh, planet name... I guess I get to name the planet because I did so awesome. <laughs> uh... Uh, I'm going to call it, um, the white space, because that's what it reminds me of. Wait, what? Oh, I guess this is actually, okay, that's how that works. You get to check your tie scores. And so then I guess it just brings you back here. More or less. All right, well, I think I'll leave it at that. If you want to try check out this game, I'll have a link for it. And, um, I don't know, it's interesting. I think it's a, it's a good time waster, if nothing else, because it's, it's extremely simplistic, minimalistic, uh, gameplay. And as long as you got a nice, you know, loopable track while you're playing, that's, what else could you ask for? So, this has been Game Hunter playing Rogue Planets, and, uh, I'll try to find something else in the meantime, because, you know, maybe I'll look for more short ones, I don't know, we'll, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, until then... Keep playing those roguelikes, take care.